guys, so a little bit of a different setting here. I decided to film outside. It was my day off. I took some pictures and I was like, you know what? Let me just go ahead and sit down and film my next video for you guys. So hopefully it's not too loud. I hope not. The road is right there, so hopefully you guys can hear me. But anyway, um, I really wanted to come and talk to you guys about my starting point for intermittent fa intermittent fasting. Now, if you don't know what it is, I'm not going to get into too specific of details just because everybody has their own way of doing things. But essentially, if you guys know me, you guys know that in the dictionary, if you look at the word yo-yo dieting, my face is on it. I have done so many things that have been successful in the past, and the only issue has been that I have not been able to sustain those things that I've been doing. So really what I wanted to do was, I actually been praying about something that I could do and I could be consistent with and God literally answered my prayers because a couple months ago I actually watched Tracy who did it and she had a great success and I started doing research and the funny part about this is I actually have a background in science, my degrees in biomolecular science and I remember studying hormones in class and I'm like, why did this not click before? So anyway, long story short, I will put the information of all the people who I researched, actual doctors, if this is not for you, you are not forced to do it with me. I just wanted to use this as a starting point to share my journey. Now the second part of this is I will be using detox teas, which you guys already know, I've reviewed quite a few and I really did love tea me. So I actually was like, hey, can I get a tumbler so I can get this tea to go? And they went ahead and sent me a tumbler as well as their skinny tea and their colon cleanse. So for 30 days at the start of my intermittent fasting journey, I will be doing the 30 day tea me cleanse. Um, I will link a link, link a link, I link a link. I'm gonna put a link to my last video, my last results. As you can see, this tea is amazing. It really isn't about the weight loss for the tea though. It's about cleansing your system and just making sure that your everything in, inside is as healthy and as good as it is outside. So those are the two things that I'm gonna be doing. If you wanna know specifically what kind of fast I'm doing, I'm specifically doing the 16 and the eight. And so what's gonna happen is I'm just gonna do that all month. Every now and then I like to push it a little bit more and do the 420, 20 and four, yeah. But really 16 and 8 is where I usually range so I don't eat anything after 6 and then I just count 16 hours after that and eat in the afternoon the next day. So that's pretty much it. I will be coming back to show you guys my results and the other half of it is I will be putting up little videos of what I eat in a day so you guys can get an idea of exactly what kind of foods I'm putting in my body and I'm really not about the restriction anymore. I do want to eat clean things and eat more on the keto side of things but um, I haven't quite yet gotten to full keto so I'm just gonna reach ketosis with intermittent fasting and then hopefully I'll be able to add in just a purely ketogenic diet or maybe do some carb cycling but if that's all gibberish to you I will put Thomas DeLauer below Dr. Berg amazing and actually Vanessa Blanco I actually met her she's amazing she does a lot of powerlifting as well so I really kind of want to get into all of that and just do a little bit more in terms in when it comes to like the wellness and the fitness piece of it so i will put all the rest of my videos below if you have not subscribed go ahead and hit the subscribe button hit the bell button so that you can catch up with me and my updates and if you want to see what i look like right now i guess i should do like a little let me show you guys so this is me starting point so there i am I mean, don't get it twisted, I'm still cute. I just wanna be a little bit smaller and maybe lose 20 pounds? Maybe 20 is too much, 15, 15 pounds. So anyway, thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you on my next video. Good morning all, so I'm here to do a quick what I eat in a day for intermittent fasting. It is the morning time, it is November 1st day one so this is essentially what I'm gonna eat every single day this week for seven days straight because <laughs> I'm lazy and this is what I grocery shopped and I like to keep things very very simple so I'm gonna start with the liquids I'm show you guys what you're gonna be eating or drinking so this right here is just apple cider vinegar and some lemon um, so the apple cider vinegar I use is either this one which is Bragg's or I use this one which has um, also has the mother you got to make sure that it has the mother so yes it also has the mother and um, this one also has pomegranate and hibiscus um, I have coconut water here because 
at the end of the day, not during my fast, okay? At the end of the day, I do drink some coconut water. I probably drink this uh, maybe within three days just because I don't want to drink the whole thing, but it's great for potassium, so that's something I probably drink um, after the gym or something or at the end of the day. Uh, this is just a can of water. I do have a YouTube little canister that I got from one of the creator workshops that I attended. And this, of course, is uh, my Teamy tumbler. Um, I do drink Teamy. This is the actual tea here. Um, this one is just the daily tea that's supposed to help keep you regulated because alongside this, this is going to help cleanse me of all the terrible things that I've been drinking. And as you see, I don't have very many tea leaves in there. And that's only because, um, number one, it's going to sit here all day. I'll probably refill it at some point. And I don't want it too potent. It's probably like a very little goes a long way. So anywho, um, to break my fast, my very first meal is going to be this. This is, I just scrambled two eggs. Um, I put some pink Himalayan salt. I did use some butter because I'm trying to do high fat. And also um, some spinach and some kale. So I have my veggie serving in there. Alongside a half avocado here for some fats and more potassium. I'm gonna have a pomegranate today. I have a few to get through, so that's gonna be one thing I eat. And then my second meal of the day is this. This is some spaghetti squash with some soup, some pasta fazool. And since the soup is a little bit thicker, um, it's, it is, what, what does it have in it? It has um, tomatoes, obviously, beans, um, a little bit of pasta, some carrots. So yeah, it's essentially just like pasta and some meat with some spaghetti squash and for dessert I'm just gonna have two of these cookies and these are just to show you what they are the Annie's double chocolate chip cookies and these are like hundred and thirty calories each. if you want to know exactly what they do have in them it's pretty good um, let's see total fat 7 grams saturated fat 2.7 grams um, the carbs are only 14 grams um, and then only nine sugars so the reason why I like these is because, and I like to keep carbs in, is because I will be working out every single day this week, so I do want to keep carbs in my meals, uh, but the idea really is to keep it low. So that's it guys, that's all that I eat, or at least that's what I'm eating this week. I hope you guys enjoy this small little video, and next week I'll probably do another one of these just to show you guys how I switch it up so I have a little bit more variety while I'm doing intermittent fasting. But that's it. Thank you guys for watching. Time to go to work for me, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye!